Hi, and welcome back to Telltale's The Walking Dead. We're continuing on with episode four. This is part two. We've just got out of a sewer. Let's see what happens in this one. All right, so we're in this fallout shelter that we just crawled through. Oh, probably. There probably is someone living this. here. It's enough to keep people alive for months. Whoa. Whoa, it actually is. I wonder if this is Molly's place and she knows all about this. She would have to know about this, right? Oh. Hi. Who are you? You know what? This is the Crawford people. It's all right. It's okay. I, I don't want any trouble. Neither do we. Which is why you'd do well to turn around and leave. I can't. Right now. No. Look, I'm sorry I disturbed you folks. <laughs> I'll just be going. You can't let him leave. He's from Crawford. Why not? If he goes oh. back there and they find out we're down here. Are you from Crawford? No. They don't lie to me. I know. No, Where we're else not. can he be from? Everywhere else around here is dead. I came here with a small group hoping to find a boat. We just want to get out of here. How about you just let me go? Uh-huh. Ain't no boats around here. Crawford took everything. Yeah, I heard. You can't trust him, Vernon. You can't let him leave. It's what okay. What do you want me to do? Shoot him in the head? <laughs> Why not? Be more of a mercy than anyone from Crawford ever showed us. Think, Vernon. What do you think they'll do uh -huh. if they find out we're down here, right under their feet? Damn it. You're right. No. I'm sorry, friend. Can't take the risk. No. I'm not from Crawford, but I saw what they did up there. It made me sick. I'm not like them. And I don't think you are either. No. I think you're a good man. Keep back! Or no, I swear it's okay, I'll shoot. Old, old grandpa. It's okay. It's all right. It's okay. Vernon, what the hell are you doing? Vernon! That's Relax. Parents. I'm not here right. to hurt you. <laughs> you're really not from Crawford? No. No. I'm really not. Well, uh, we are, or were. We got out of there when they started sealing up the place, you know, started weeding out the sick and the old so their yep. perfect survivor society wouldn't be threatened. No room for weakness or vulnerability in their little master race. Of you course. don't look that old, so you're sick? We're sick. We're all members of a cancer survivors group oh, who used to wow. meet here at the hospital. Oh, we're in really? remission. But that wasn't good enough for Crawford. Oh, wow. They'd already rounded up five of us before the rest of us managed oh to hole up and hide from them down here. This yeah. old basement's been abandoned for years. What is this? A morgue? Oh, it is. Yeah. Irony's <laughs> always high on my list when I'm looking for a place to survive. <laughs> How did you find your way down here? A few of us got boxed in by walkers up on the street. Came down here trying to get away. Now I just want to get out of here and get back to my own people. Mm. Well, that sewer system you came through runs all over the city. It'll take you wherever you want to go. <laughs> when it's... Oh. Those sewers are like a damn maze. Any chance you could help me find my way back? Look, I'd like to help mm. you, but we've all got our own problems. Yes, Two of I our understand. Group is sick and need constant care, and I'm the only doctor here. Oh, he's Besides, a why should we help you? <laughs> Jeez. Look, I'm sorry if I scared you. I just want to get back to my people. Back to Clementine. She's your daughter? Mm, yes and no. No. She lost her real parents. I'm doing what I can. You're not seriously considering going with him. It's all right, Bree. I had a daughter, too. Lost her in the first days. I'll be damned if I'll just sit back and let that happen to someone else. Thank you. We need you here. Don't worry. I'll be back before you know it. Thank you. Let's go. Thank you. Oh, he's lovely. He wants to help. Thank you. Oh. Is that his wife? I think it might be. She's really sick. She's not doing well. Thanks, guys. Sorry I took your grandpa away. 
Clementine? Yes! Clem? Where is she, though? Is she safe? Molly? Oh, hey, you made it back. Uh, yeah? Who's this? <laughs> he didn't tell you about me? Understandable, I guess. I'm the one who put that beating on him when he tried to jump me back at the river. <laughs> Who's the fossil? <gasps> Where's Clementine? She's around here somewhere. Okay. Relax. I got her and Kenny both back safely. You're welcome, <laughs> by the way. I just wanted to know. I think you have something that belongs to me. Yes, I can give it back to you. <laughs> this poor old dude. He helped. Lee, thank and God you're back. Jeez. Krista, what's wrong? It's Omid. He's gotten worse. Much worse. We have a doctor now, though. We have a man wounded. Who's this? <laughs> this is Vernon. He's a doctor. Oh, thank God. Could you take a look at him? Please? You have to help us. He will. He will. Please. He will. He's a good man. I'll see what I can do. Take me to him. Yes. <laughs> I'm so glad we've got help. I like our little group. Oh, he's not doing well, is he? He's got so much worse. Oh, me, honey. You're gonna be all right. Lee brought a doctor. All right, let's take a look at him. We don't have any medicine or anything. I work better without an audience. I'm sure you have more things of your own to attend to. <laughs> okay. Point taken. Let's go find Clem. Clementine. Yes. Clementine? Let's go find our little girl. Where is she? Clementine, you in here? Where is she? <laughs> I wonder if she is... Oh, there's a drawing. What has she done? <gasps> Clem's oh. drawings. But where is she? I wonder if she's outside in the garden. Don't see her anywhere out there. Uh, no walkers either, though. <laughs> That's a good sign. Where is she? Clem, you in here? <laughs> she could literally be anywhere. Clementine? Why is she hiding? I don't think she's hiding. I think she's just somewhere playing. I'll have time to rest later. <laughs> Doesn't look like she's in here. Okay. Let's leave. Hang on. Hang Clementine. on. Clementine. You hear? She hasn't been taken, has she? By the person on the radio. Oh no. No, 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 no. I think she has. Oh no. Hello? Oh no. <gasps> Who's that? What That's are you doing? Molly. Oh, you know, just poking around. You won't find anything. We already searched the place. You'd be surprised what people miss. <laughs> Trust me, I've been doing this for a while. Where's Clementine? Where's Clementine? Don't ask me, I'm not her keeper. Hey, do I look like I'm in the mood to be jerked around? <laughs> Where did she go? Last I saw, she was downstairs with your redneck friend and that college kid who hangs around with him. Why don't you go bug them? Okay, I think I will. I think I will. But... I'm just looking around for now. Clementine? I'm so worried. She's been taken. I don't care about that. I just want to find Clementine. Okay. No sign of her in here. She's been taken. Let's go downstairs, like he said then. Look out the window. She's not there. Don't see her out there. Oh no. Clem? No. Clementine? 
Okay. Let's go downstairs. Clementine! Where is she? Come out! Please! But where's Kenny? That she's Kenny? not with them either. <gasps> oh hey, you made it back. Good job. Good job. What the, what the hell? hell do you think He's you're doing? Drunk. What does it look like? He's drunk. Where'd you get the bottle? Found it. Oh. First good thing that's happened since. <sighs> hey, take it easy. Think you've had enough. To hell with you. Getting wasted's not gonna help anyone. Mm -mm. Yeah? Well, what is? We are fucked. <laughs> Molly said there's not a single boat left in Savannah. No way out. We got walkers all around us. That crazy fuck on the radio messing with us. Hell, if now ain't the time for a drink? She's gone. Ben! Oh, I give up. Ben, where is she? Have either of you seen Clementine? Oh Damned if I know. Gotta be around here somewhere. Ben, I gave you one job when I left here. Take care of Clementine. <gasps> then she shows up out on River Street looking for me. What the hell happened? Hey, don't put all that on me. Omid took a turn for the worse and Krista asked me to help. I'm sorry, I'm doing the best I can here. She was frantic and things got kind of crazy. I told Clementine to stay put. What else could I do? Don't be sorry. Just tell me where the hell she is now. I think she went out to play in the backyard. On her own? With no one watching her? Man, will you get off my back? She's fine out there. She's not. Be or it's your ass. She's not because we've got that person watching us in the backyard and she's been taken. Okay? She's been taken by either that person that's watching Clementine? or by the people at Crawford. Clementine! Though why they want kids, I have no idea. They apparently don't want kids there. She hasn't been in there. It's all... In yep, it's grown. Don't think anyone came in through there. Yep. I can't tell if she's got out. That's the same as it was. Maybe she's in the doghouse. You better not be hiding in there. Nope. She's gone. Where is she? What the? Where are you? <gasps> okay. What the? Is she in there? What is this? Is she? Wee! Oh my god. Hey girl. Come look, look what I found. You little scamp. You little scamp. What is it? A boat. It's 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 a boat. <laughs> it's a boat. It's a boat. It's a boat. <laughs> Whoa. I know, right? <sighs> Kenny. It's a boat. <laughs> oh, this is amazing. No way. Now we just need a car. And we can get out. Oh, wow. This is amazing. But how did she get in there? Yes. This is so good. Hey, how's our mead? Oh. 
Olmede's doing okay? As well as can be expected under the circumstances. I did what I could for him. Cleaned out the wound, but he's got a real infection. Yeah. Running a fever. Without antibiotics, I... Will you quit pacing? You're making everyone nervous. <laughs> Why are you even still here? Calm down. Hey, if your friend really can get that boat working, you're taking me with you as payment for saving your asses. <laughs> I figure that's fair enough, don't you? Right. I don't know if I like her yet. Well? You want the good news or the bad news? <laughs> Let's get the bad news out of the way first. Bad news is, she's not taking us anywhere the shape she's in right now. Gas tank's empty and the battery's dead. Okay. So what's the good news? That's it. That's all she needs. Some gas and a battery. <laughs> Other than that, she's good to go. Well, right. How are we supposed to get that stuff? We can get it. Crawford. Sounds like Crawford is the one place that has everything we need. Mm-hmm. Maybe we should try there. Now hold on a minute. Surely we have to try? If there are people left in this city who are still alive, who still have supplies, what harm can it do to ask? Trust me, you don't know these people. I do. You mm. showing up with a wounded man, might as well put a noose oh, around his neck. that's so true, that's so they true. You don't exactly welcome children with open arms either. What the hell kind of a place are we talking about here? The worst kind? But I don't see what other choice we have. And just how exactly do you figure we do this? Stealth? Because from what I've heard, that place ain't exactly friendly to outsiders. That's putting it mildly. There's got to be some way we can sneak in there undetected. There might actually be a way. I know the oh. sewer system that runs beneath <gasps> Crawford like the yes. back of my hands. Y'all yes. wouldn't happen to have a map by any chance. Molly? Yeah, actually. Oh, yes, I do. Of uh, The map of Savannah. Oh, my God. Amazing. I think I could lead us through so we could pass under the perimeter and right into the center where they <laughs> okay. keep the supplies. We come up right underneath them, take them by surprise, wow. grab what we need, and get out before they even knew what hit them. Let's That's do it. actually not the worst idea I've ever heard. <laughs> I mean, it's close, but I don't know. Maybe it could work. Yes. I've thought about it before, just never had the people to do it. But I think if we all work together, we could pull it off. Okay. And what do you want in return for all this help you're giving us? <laughs> mm. Crawford doesn't just have what you need for your boat. Oh. They're also well stocked with medical supplies. Medicine that my people could use, just mm -hmm. as yours could. We can mm -hmm. do this. We have to. So, yes. it's decided then? We're going to Crawford? How do we even know where they store their supplies? I used to watch them from one of the bell towers just outside the perimeter. I've seen them carrying all kinds Perfect. of stuff into that old Catholic school off the town square. I think they're Catholic using it as some school. kind of supply okay. depot. Mm -hmm. There's a good chance mm -hmm. we'll find what we need in there. Let's do it. I don't know about you, kid, but I'd rather take a chance on doing something than just sitting around here waiting to die. Yes. That boat out there is an answered prayer. Let's do just it. Just gotta push a little bit farther. Mm hmm Are you in or out? Let's say you We should been. go tonight, under cover of I dark. I don't know why he doesn't want I'll go to. let my people know. Give you all a chance to prepare. I'll be back before midnight. Be okay. careful. That's how I'm still alive. <laughs> Okay, I'm happy with this plan. I'm Don't very you happy. Stay in your room. How long have you been there? <laughs> She's Is a little it going sneak. To be dangerous? Is what gonna be dangerous? Going to Crawford. Crawford. Yeah. Hmm. I don't know. I can't lie to you, Clem. I just don't know. I don't we want don't anyone know. else to die. Same. Neither do I, Clem, but sometimes we have to take that kind of risk. Yeah. I guess yeah. I should go get ready. Oh, uh, say what now? <laughs> you said you'd need all of us to do this, and you said I'm a big help, remember? Mm. Molly said Crawford is the only place left in Savannah that still has people. That means it must be where my <gasps> mom and dad are, oh. right? Oh, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. Where I'm going, it's just too dangerous. For children especially. You said I'm supposed to always stay close to you. I know. Should she come or not? Can't I come with you? I want her to. I want her to come with me. Oh, what do I pick? I need to pause. 
I want Clementine to come with me. I think it's safer if I know where she is at all times, but then I worry that she's going to be a liability and she's going to knock something over or make a noise and that's going to distract people. That's my only concern with Clementine. And if she stays behind, who's she staying with? I don't trust anyone else to look after her except Lee. Okay, girl, she's coming with me. She's safer with Lee, definitely. Okay, you can come, but you have to promise to stay quiet and do exactly what you're told the whole time we're there. Please, don't okay. make a sound. Okay, I'm gonna go get ready. At least I know where she is at all times then, okay? I want to make sure that she's okay. She is, like, almost my number one priority in this game. And having her with me, I know where she is. And I trust her. I trust her. We need to learn to trust each other. Check out what I found in the garage. Hatchet, hacksaw, some other tools. Nice. Might come in handy on this little break-in. Yes. Nice. Go on, Kenny. Can I talk to you a minute? What's up? I took another look at the boat. Yeah. She's a 30-footer. Yeah. So? So we're going to have a capacity problem. Yeah. Boat that size ain't going to hold more than five people. Five. Even with one of them a kid. No Me, way. You, Clem, Krista, Omi, Ben. It's too many. Assuming everyone makes it back alive, that's still too one many. too many. Even if we cut Molly loose. Before this is over, we have to make a decision. You're not serious. Look, I'm just saying, if we want the best chance of... Oh, hi. She's here. Who the hell is this? <laughs> this is Bree. She can help Bree. us. Help us how? I was a student at the school where Crawford keeps their supplies. Okay. I know the layout. With her help, we're in and out faster. Anyone okay. have a problem with that? Okay, let's let's do what it. What are we waiting for? Let's get moving. Okay. I think I already know who I'm gonna say hold no to with the boat. You ready? Ready. Hey, whoa, hold on a minute. You're not taking her with us. <laughs> Did you not hear anything I said about the kind of place Crawford is? If you take her in there and they find her, I'm not leaving her alone in the house with only Omi to protect her. It's just not yes, happening. Yes, that's so true. For what it's worth. I don't think it's a great idea either. She's coming. Deal yep. with it. You heard the man. Let's yep. move out. She's not staying there with just Omid. No. No, no, no. She's coming with me. She'll be safe here. She'll be safe with us. I have a good feeling about this. I think that we're going to get the supplies and get this should be it. We're on right the boat underneath and go. The center of Crawford. The old school should Whoa. be directly above us. Okay, people. This is it. Remember the plan. Nice. We stay quiet, we stay hidden, and we stay together. We find what we need, and we get the hell out before anyone even knows we're there. Got it? Yes. And that part about staying close, that goes double for you. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Let's go. So that's the school just there. Uh, I think that's the school. That's cool. We're so close is already. Everybody? There should be guards patrolling. Okay. What? Are you disappointed? <laughs> it's just strange, is all. I think I see one over there by the door. Okay. Okay. Me and Kenny will sneak out, try to take him out quiet. The rest of you wait for our signal, then follow us over. Everybody got it? We're not killing okay, him, Kenny, are we? Let's do this quiet. No shooting unless there's no other choice. Okay. Haha, <laughs> he's got his sniper. Okay. Are we just going to knock him out? Or are we actually putting that hatchet in his head? What are we going to do to him? What the fuck? <gasps> okay. He ain't a guard. <gasps> um, 
Crawford's not what it used to be, I think. Crawford what has the changed. What fuck is a walker doing inside here? No. Get inside, oh, fast! Damn it. That's okay. Let's just get in here, get our supplies, and get out, right? Okay, we can board this up. We'll be fine. We will be fine. But what's happened to Crawford? It's... Where is everyone? Oh, an abandoned, creepy old school? Okay. <laughs> we need to put Fuck. something... Fuck! Do you think they saw there. us? Uh... Your guess is as good as mine. Don't know. It's okay, sweetie. Well, I'm not gonna lie. I mean, what I don't know. What the hell happened here? I thought this place was supposed to be secure. I don't know. What always happens, I guess. In the end, the dead always win. Oh man, we are so right. screwed. No, this is good. It is good because... Vernon's right. We can deal with walkers easier than armed guards. I agree. Yes. So long as we don't let him box us in, we can still do this. The plan hasn't changed. The plan hasn't changed? Every time walkers show up, the plan changes. Do you even have any idea how many of them are out there? No. You want to do a head count? Or do you <laughs> want to get what we need and get the hell out of here? Mm-hmm. Come on. I think I know which way to head. Okay. Just follow Bree. We'll be okay. Just need a I couple a of things. I got a bad feeling about this. <laughs> I don't. I actually feel really positive. I think it's going to be fine. I can hear them. They're behind that door. Which is probably our supply room. Isn't it? Just keep moving. <laughs> Here. Wow, there's a lot of us in here. Okay. Okay. Looks okay. Everybody in. Okay. Okay. Hopefully we'll be okay. Armory. It's not exactly what we Figures. need. Oh, wow. Looks like they were using this room as some kind of command center. Yeah. Okay, so now what? Where do we start looking? No idea. Bree, you got any, any advice? Here. Just give me a sec. Okay. Battery, medicine, fuel. Any idea where we could find a battery? Uh, maybe at the auto shop. There used to be one in the alley outside the fire escape. Okay. Yep, it's called Herman's. You can't miss it. Right. Fuel. Where can we find some fuel for the boat? There's a maintenance shed across from the playground here. Okay. If they were storing fuel, that's probably where it'll be. What about the medicine? <laughs> right here. Nurse's station. They were using it as a medical facility. Okay. How do you know that? Just makes sense, doesn't it? She's from Crawford. She knows. Okay. I'll make the run to the maintenance shed it. for the fuel. It'll be faster if I go with you. I can take you right to it. Okay. I'll come too. No, two people's enough. You stay here, see if you can use any of those tools we brought to get that armory door open. Okay. We might need to shoot our way out of here. <laughs> I'll go for the medicine. That's kind of true. I'll come with you. I know what to take. Okay. Guess that leaves me to go find us a battery. <laughs> I'll go with you. Watch your back. 
Fantastic. Okay, we've got a plan. Everyone be careful. Stay close to one another. We'll all meet back here. Good luck. Right. Which one's going to die today? <laughs> I thought Molly was coming with us. What about me? What can I do? Stay with me. I need you to stay here with Ben and watch over our command. No, 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 no. I'm putting you in charge of it, okay? Come You're leaving me. me with Ben? I'm not leaving you with Ben. <laughs> I'm leaving him with you. Understand? <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Act before you know. Oh, I want her to come with us. She's so cute little sweetie but I want her to come with us though nothing but crayons and construction paper <laughs> well that gives Clementine something to do while we're gone okay we're going so to the motor pool debris, fuel is at the maintenance shed yes yeah. might be at the nurse's office and a battery would probably be at the auto shop out through here yep yeah. okay Fire escape. Bree said the entrance to the auto shop was in the alleyway by this fire escape. Okay, we gotta go up, down. Okay, I think I've, I think I've got it. <laughs> She's you at okay, school. Clem? Yeah. Aww. This desk is just like the ones we have in my school. Yeah, I know. I know it's weird, but I kind of miss it, being in school. Yeah. I know. Me too. I used to be a teacher, remember? <laughs> Tell you what, when we find ourselves a safe place, set up a little classroom. Oh. Just you and me. Oh, will there be homework? <laughs> no homework. No. Oh, Do you think that's things lovely. will ever be normal again? Just like the way they were before? Maybe. Yeah, it may take a while, but yeah. I do. Don't you? I hope so. That's good. You hold on to that hope. Yep. It's the one thing none of this can take away. That's right. That is right. All right, let's go and find this battery I think we're looking for. It's either battery or fuel. I think we're looking for batteries. I've got Molly with me. Hang on, don't I have Molly with me? Uh, there she is. <laughs> I thought she left me. Shell casings. The alleyway to the auto shops down here. You coming or not? Oh yeah, I am. I'm just picking up some ammunition. I've already been fired. Oh, Worthless. right. That's not good. Huh? I can open this locker. Curious if there's anything in there. Can't open it without the combination. Ooh. Too bad I don't know the combination to any of these. <laughs> I want the combination. That's Vernon. Hmm. I don't know where I'm going to find the combination. Damn. <laughs> oh, well, I might find it on my... In my travels, huh? Must be the guy who ran this place. Looks like he figured himself as some kind of supreme leader. Reminds me of Lily. Alright, no combination. We'll, we'll just head out. This must be the door to the alleyway where the auto shop is. Where the hell is Molly? I don't know. Why didn't she wait for us? It's so annoying. <laughs> Why not wait, lady? Ooh. Molly, you out here? <laughs> Why just go on ahead? I'm not going that way. Oh, come on. Delivery is made in rear. Hang on. I just saw her. She ran this way. That was Molly, right? That was weird. 
That was really weird. She... Something ran past. This is so weird. I don't get it. Okay. Oh. All right. I guess we're going in here. Why hasn't she waited? I find her very rude. Damn. It's jammed tight. There has to be a way in, though. There's got to be another way. I find her extremely rude for just walking off like that. Can't go that close. way. What? <laughs> okay. That's Molly. He's mine. What is she doing? What were you doing up there? I don't know. Okay. Molly? She, she likes Molly. it. It's okay, she what? likes it. I think you got it. <laughs> One more. For luck. Wow. He's wearing medical scrubs. Some kind of Ooh. scientist or doctor, maybe? Yeah, well, he ain't shit now. <sighs> She's very angry. Did you find us a way in? Yeah, but the garage door's jammed. Can't raise it. Can go up a tiny, tiny bit. Not enough. Not a problem. Look what I found. Oh. Oh, yeah. Beautiful. Work. <laughs> Uh oh. Hi. That fence is not secure. Molly can have more fun times with them. What are we gonna do? Let's just get in there as quick as we can. Come then we'll on. take we'll just take the jack out and that's it. They're so slow anyway. They're so slow. We can do this. Come on, get in. And then we're just... Oh! He's still alive! <laughs> he is still alive. I thought she finished him off. Would they not crawl underneath? I guess Take a I look around. Not. I'll make sure no stragglers get under this door. Okay. Alright, so let's find the battery. The lights are still blinking in that car, so... Can't reach it up there. Let's lower it and get the battery out. No power. No power. All right. It looks like it's the hose for the lift hydraulics. All right. Let's get this. Let's get this power on then. I think I gotta leave the room. It's locked. No way in. Okay. Okay. I don't think I can pry that hose apart with just my hands. Maybe if I had something to cut it with. Alright, point taken. Let's find something to use. Can we lift that? Might be a battery in there. Is that a battery? But it has to be the right battery, right? Well, I can see where the battery should be, but it's not. <laughs> Perfect. Right. Okay, maybe Molly has a tool that I can cut something with. Something you need? Mm-hmm. Think I can borrow that uh, hook thing of yours? I don't know. Hilda and I have been through a lot together. <laughs> Hilda. Hilda. That's what I call her. Don't judge. <laughs> Please, can I borrow Hilda? I'll take good care of her. She won't get a scratch. Well, she can do it. Now. Not a scratch. 
if she's so concerned about Hilda, she can use it. That's it. Okay, so. You did it. Oh, yes. Whoa, whoa. That's probably not good. No shit! I'll try to hold him off. Hurry! <laughs> There's the battery. <laughs> Finally, something goes right. Finally. All right. Still attached to the terminals. Okay. All right. <laughs> Still attached to the terminals. Give me a Still second. Still attached to the terminals. Come on. Got that okay. one off. <laughs> I'm off. trying my best. There we go. We have our battery. Yeah, but we still got a oh. problem here. Why here, don't you guys? I would. Okay, follow me. Close the door. You know? Uh oh. Move your ass. <laughs> Let's go then. They can't get up here. But this is not very good. I don't know. Skyline. Shoot it? It doesn't matter about making noise because they're already here. Wow, she's pretty cool. Molly is pretty cool, I gotta say. Is she gonna. Yep. Didn't know if she would actually help me. <laughs> yes! We have a battery. We just need the fuel and the medical supplies. Hopefully, the other guys are coping okay. Okay, so now we're on a roof. <laughs> you ever stop complaining? Come on. He was just observing. Wow. That is cool. Come on, what are you, chicken? <laughs> Jump! Uh, I don't know, man. <laughs> wow she is really strong because I don't think Lee is a very light person that was really impressive really cool the elusive lock to lockers oh there we go come on later there we go something I gotta do first what? oh what catch you later but Wait, you have you my still battery, got the battery. Yeah, I think I'll hold on to it. Make sure you don't leave without me. See you back in class. Molly! Right. God damn it, what the hell is she doing? Right. <laughs> there must be something in that locker, you know. I'm going to see if I can find... Um, hello? Here. <laughs> <laughs> it's all good. Ooh, just slam his head in there. <laughs> Lee, do something! Oh, you do something! Pick up the hatchet! Oh, jeez, man. Break the door with something! With the hatchet. Come on. We got it. That's not gonna hold a lot. No. Damn well better. Not for long. There's so many of them. You got the fuel. Yes. Let's not start high fiving each other just yet. Let's get the hell back to the classroom. Give us a hand with these fuel cans. They weigh a goddamn ton. Yep. We've got fuel, we've got a battery. We could just leave, I mean. We don't really need his medicine. Where's Clem? There You're she back. Is. Yeah, and we made out pretty good too. Great work, Kenny. How you doing with that door? Not so good. <laughs> Here, let me Can give you, you a just hand. Bust into it, into it. Jeez. Did you get that battery yet? Mm-hmm. Yeah, Molly has it. She should be back here soon. She'd better be. Yeah, she better be all right. She'd better be all right. Come on, guys. Surely you can do it. Open the damn door. What do we still need? We already got the fuel and the battery. Once we find some medicine, we'll be good to go. So where's this battery you found? Molly, Molly has it. it. She ran off to do something. Better bring it back here. I don't know why you trusted that girl with it. We hardly know her. <gasps> she took off, she man. She saved your life, didn't she? <laughs> yeah, 
But what has she done for me lately? <laughs> oh, Kenny, you are so no, sassy. Wait. There is something you can help me with. Okay. Something that's been on my mind. I could use your opinion. All what right. is it? It's Kenny. Since I've been helping him work on the boat, I've gotten to know him a little better. He's a good guy, you know? Yeah. And it's eating me up knowing what I know. Oh. I've been thinking about telling him the truth. Ben, come on. This again? <laughs> it's my fault Duck and Katja got killed. If I hadn't screwed up back mm. at the motor inn, they'd still be alive. How am I supposed to just carry something like that around? True. I have to tell him. You know what? Tell I agree. him. I think you should tell him. Just not now. You don't get it, Lee. What am I supposed to do whenever he talks about Katja and Duck? Just nod and pretend like it wasn't my fault. I can't do it anymore. Ben, listen. Kenny seems like he's got his shit back together because right now he's got a purpose. But he's still in a real bad place. Mm -hmm. You tell him now, he's gonna lose it. And then we're all screwed. There'll come a time when he's ready to hear it. Mm -hmm. But it's not now. Not yet. Yes, not right now. I hear you. I'm gonna get back to this. I don't want Ben to come with us on the boat. So, I kind of hope that um, <laughs> Kenny kills him or something. Looks like they have quite a system here. Huh. Perfect's final solution. I don't know what that system is. Oh, that's the system. Right. You can see by the numbers. Initials of person conducting the search. Right, that makes sense. That's actually really clever. You okay, Clem? Yeah. Where's Molly? She had to go run an errand. She'll be back soon. I hope she's okay. She'll be fine. She's pretty tough. Just sit tight, okay? I need to go take care of a few things. All right. I think I've looked everywhere in this room. I think I need to leave the room. Maybe I need to go and help with the medicine, you know. I thought the others would have been back by now. Maybe they're just really rubbish at, at finding things. Maybe I have to help? Here, I, guess. I mean, where is everybody? I ain't going out there! <laughs> Where is everybody else? That's the alley where I came from. I think I might need to go and help get the medicine, you know. I can't open it. <gasps> oh dear. Vernon must be trapped in there. That's why they're taking so long. How? Oh. I can't shoot all of them. I don't have enough bullets. <laughs> this is an, a gun with endless, endless bullets. <laughs> I am thankful for that. Are they okay? It's okay, it's just me. What the hell happened? <laughs> they wandered into the hallway after we got inside. Damn. I think they must have heard us rooting around in here. The whole place is infested. Mm -hmm. They're everywhere. Calm down. I took care of them. <laughs> what about the mids? Did we find what we need? Yeah, that's our other problem. Great. Take a look. Oh no, what? It's locked, right? We don't have a combination. Looks like they were keeping all the prescription meds in that safe, locked up tight. Hmm. Can we just guess the combination? It's a four-digit code. You do the math. Well, I doubt yeah. they just wrote it down and left it here for us to find. We should just try busting it open. We don't have any other choice. Okay, you get started. I'll take a look around, see if I can find anything useful. If there is a combination, they would have found it by now, What's right? This on the floor? Oh, it's a baby. 
It's a sonogram. That's of a baby. Oh, there's blood. There's a camcorder. This is weird. What were they filming? Go deep inside. That is super weird. We could just shoot. Y'all already the checked cabinet. these drawers? Yes, Lee. Nothing in there worth taking. Right. Maybe we'll just. What if we just like try and shoot it? I don't know. Do you think shooting it open would work? Only thing that would accomplish is getting us all killed. <laughs> so no, I don't. All right. I guess we just got to look around. There's dried blood on this printout, and on the floor. Looks like a trail of it from the safe to the camera over there, then out the door. Hmm. What the hell happened here? From the safe to the camera and then out the door. I don't know, but that seems quite strange. What is this? A copy machine. Not that it matters with no power around here. I'll have to take time to rest later, I think. Just a bunch of papers. No safe combination, though. That's a phone? Medical file? Anna Correa. Guess she must have been a patient here. And what's this? Oh. Let's put that in the camcorder. What have they been doing? What is this? Vernon, Krista, come look at this. This is day 82 since the outbreak. Oh. 1547. Dr. Logan in consultation with patient Anna Correa. Okay. Why are you recording this? Regulations. Oberson has ordered me to keep records of all medical examinations and consultations. I need you to brace yourself, Anna. The sonogram confirms that you're pregnant. <gasps> They're gonna kill her. Oh god, oh god, oh god. <laughs> As you know, the rules are very clear. The termination wow. is mandatory. You don't have to tell them. Tell them it was just nausea. But you gave me something for it and it went away. This is my problem, not yours. If Oberson finds out that I could see old evidence of a pregnancy, I'm sorry, but these are the rules. I'm going to give you a sedative. It'll make the procedure easier on you. Show me the numbers. I don't want the procedure. <laughs> I want my baby. I can't do this. I can't do this. Anna. You don't have a choice. Exactly. Now, if you like, you can take some time with this. But I need you to come back no later than tomorrow. Or I'll have no choice but to inform Oberson myself. She'll probably I'm sorry. leave. Yeah. She just... I, she, she wouldn't come back. Oh, dude. Go to the safe. Come on. Damn it. <laughs> Damn it. We almost had it. I know, what right? What kind of place was this? Like Molly said, the worst kind. Lee, yeah. maybe there's another tape. We gotta keep looking. I okay. think I recognize that doctor. He was one of the walkers out <gasps> oh. in the alley by the auto shop. Maybe you should search it. See what he's got on him. Okay. Interesting idea. Okay, so we're gonna have to go out and search that doctor. He also has... He's the owner of one of the lockers as well. I should be able to get maybe both combinations... So we're going to head out into the alleyway. Oh, I hope this is going to be safe. We need to search one of those bodies. I think if we just go the same way. So in here and climb up. <laughs> oh, jeez. Who's that? Is that Molly? What fell on him though? Something fell on his head? <laughs> huh. Oh, there he is. That's the guy that we need. Don't you... I wish I knew how to run. I would like to run. No, you ain't getting out. I need you. I'm sorry, but I need you. He, why would he keep the password on him? Why would he? Oh, the tape. 
This might be just what we need. Yes, it's another tape. What's this? <gasps> Looks like some kind of code. But Vernon said the safe combination was only four numbers. That's his locker combination. It's fantastic. Shit, time to go. Uh huh. Right, now I can finally open that locker. I've been really wondering what was in there. Here we go. Here we go. Okay. This must have been his locker. Yes. What's in there? A tape. A safe Ooh. combination has got to be on one of these. Perfect. All right. So now we have two tapes to watch. Two creepy tapes. I found two more tapes. One of them is dated October 10th. That's the day after the first one we watched. Put it in. Okay. Have you made a decision? I thought you said I didn't have a choice. Well, technically you do. You can terminate the pregnancy or leave Croft. Oh, wow. Of course, that would be a death sentence for both you and your unborn child. Maybe that's best. Wow. I stayed up all last night thinking about this. Why are we even trying to survive? To keep on living, if this is what it takes. If this yes. is what it's turned us into. I don't make the rules, Anna. Doctor, I'm begging you. Please help me. Maybe one day when things are different, you can try again. But for now, today, we have to do this. Seven, two... Oh. Okay. No. No. Wow. No. Wow. I wonder if that person... No, 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 no. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That was creepy. That I was creepy. Know what happened to Crawford. Uh -huh. More importantly, we got the combination. <laughs> Whoa. Krista, are you all right? What's wrong? It's nothing. That was just hard to watch. Don't worry about me. I'm fine. Hmm. All right. Let's get those meds and get the hell out of here. I'm a bit suspicious. I'm a bit suspicious We're in about business. her. Antibiotics, morphine... We'll take as much of this as we can carry. Great. Okay, I think we're good. This is more than enough for your people and mine. Let's go. Okay. You know, I found a third tape in the locker outside. Maybe there's something else on there. We got the meds for Omid. That's all I care about. We'll head back to the classroom. Don't take too long, Lee. I'm curious about what's on that tape. Let's check it out. Let's check that out. What is it? <gasps> Listen, it's... as fun as this was, I have to put a stop to this little arrangement. This is the last I can give you. Oh. Why? Oberson had someone down here yesterday taking inventory. He's really cracking down. I just oh. can't risk it. We had a deal. <laughs> yes, we had a deal. We don't anymore. Uh -huh. My sister needs this medicine. Without it, she'll die, or she'll start showing symptoms, and they'll take her away. I can't let that happen. I'm sorry, Molly. I've right. done all I can, but right. I have to look out for myself here. Yeah, that's the Crawford way, uh -huh. isn't it? <laughs> Making sense. Makes sense. I knew Molly was from Crawford. I knew it. Well, shit. I wonder if we should say anything to Molly about that. Things are very quiet here at the moment. Jesus oh. Christ! <laughs> oh, you're scared the shit out of me. Where the fuck have you been? Sightseeing. I'll take that battery now. Oh, mm -hmm. yeah. Uh, about that. Uh-huh. You didn't lose it, did you? I'm just kidding. <laughs> Here you go. 
Thank you. Should we say anything? What's that? Nothing. It's a picture of her sister. You can quit with the act, Molly. I know you're from Crawford. What? Mm -hmm. Who told you that? I saw you on a security tape. Why'd you lie to me? I said there were stories about Crawford. I never said that's how I knew about it. Yeah. I never lied to you, and even if I did, so what? I don't owe you anything. You saved my life twice, but you can't tell me the truth? Are we really gonna <laughs> do this now? I guess that's up to you. I used to live here with my sister. She was 14 years old. When the dead started walking and Crawford shut itself in, it seemed like a pretty good deal at first. Yeah. We were safe. We had everything we needed to survive. Then the rules started coming down. No one who couldn't justify their place or in their keep. No one who required special care. My sister was diabetic, and by Crawford's rules, that made her a liability. I kept it a secret. Kept her safe for as long as I could. But in the end, I couldn't protect her. Yeah, that's when I got out. Crawford, they always talked about how their system worked. How anything was better than becoming one of them. But I saw what they'd already become. I just wish I could have seen it before it was too late. Before they came and took my sister away. Yeah. This is all I have left of her. The picture of her. I didn't have time to take it before I got out of Crawford. I just wanted it, okay? It's okay, Molly. I understand. She's pretty. What the hell? Oh. I think that's our cue to get the hell out of here. <laughs> well, who's using those bells? Who was doing that then? If it's not her. I don't know. This doesn't sound good. This does not sound good at all. Oh, Jesus! Jeff! Ben! Oh, sorry, sorry. <laughs> I just got spooked by those bells, and then I heard someone coming. What the fuck are you doing out here? <laughs> Kenny and I still can't get the door open to the armor. He sent me out to look for something we can use Jeez. to bust it open. I found this. Uh, Hang on. Ben? That was... Where did you get that? I just found it. It was stuck in the door handle at the end of the hallway back there. Ben, oh we needed that. Oh, shit! <laughs> We needed that. She seems to really enjoy this, though. She's fine. She loves it. Lee, shoot this fucker! Oh. oh. Thanks. I didn't shoot, though. It wasn't me. Good <laughs> going, kid. Nice shot. Oh. Thanks. Oh. Aren't you a clever little girl? That's good. <laughs> what the fuck is going on? They're coming. <laughs> Oh shit. That ought to hold them. Sir, but now how do we get out? Through know. the armory. We can just get this damn door open. Come on, damn you! Come on. There must be a way. There must be a better way. This is my fault. All my fault. The hell's he babbling about? Ben, we talked about this. No. Oh Wait. no. I want to oh, know no. what he oh, meant. Oh no. Oh what no. do you mean this is all your fault? Oh no. Penny, I'm so sorry. It's not the time. I'm so sorry, man. Kid, this ain't the best time. Whatever you did, save it for later. Ben, we don't have time for this now. I'm sorry, Lee. I can't do this anymore. He's got a right to know. Know what? It's been me all along, putting all of us in danger. Katja and Duck, it was all me. It was all me. Wait a minute. What are you saying? It was me who made the deal with the bandits at the He's motor dead. inn, slipping them supplies. I thought maybe I could keep them off our backs. When it got discovered, that's when they attacked. And that's when Duck... Mm-hmm. He's dead. <laughs> Kitty man, I agree with you. You should kick his ass. But now's not the time. <laughs> Gotta focus on getting out of here. You little yep. pissant! You're fucking dead, you hear me? Dead! My wife and child! You gotta both fucking kill! Kitty, mm -hmm. listen to me. You can whip his skinny little ass yep. later. Do it later, right Kenny. Now we gotta go! Nice Do it later. Not the time, Molly. Mm -mm. If this asshole thinks he's getting on my boat after what he did, he's out of his motherfucking mind! He's Kenny, not, we'll sort no. this out later. 
after we get out of here, okay? Mm -hmm. Ain't nothing to sort out. I just told you the way it's gonna be. The boat's not big enough for all of us. Somebody's mm -hmm. gotta get left behind. Might as well be this piece of shit right here. Yeah, well, I vote we leave him. I'm sorry, Ben. I know you mean well. But all I want to do is get back to Omid, and you mm -hmm. put that at risk. Wait, don't I get a vote? <laughs> oh, come on then. Of course you do. Ben's nice. He's my friend. We don't leave friends behind. That's my vote. We can't take everybody One though. Thought, I think I'm gonna abstain. <laughs> <Lee>? <laughs> oh. I can't do this right now. I abstain. We'll figure this out later. Yes, later. Come on, dudes. What about the rest of us? Don't we get a say? <laughs> She's gone. Oh my god. Wow. Now can we go? Yes, please. Let's just go. Well, that's one less that doesn't get to vote. Oh my god. That was crazy. So much for the armory. <laughs> What's left of it? Ah. What it is A here anyway. That's it. Damn it. You didn't close that door behind us? I couldn't. The lock was busted. Great. What are we going to do? Just fucking great. Come on. There's got to be a way out down here. What are we going to do? That's the way out. It's not gonna hold. Back upstairs. That is not a way out. That's hey, one look. gun. Yep, yep, yep. We have a gun. I'm just gonna have to shoot everyone, aren't I? Damn it. Yep. How many rounds does this shotgun have? It must be endless, like our good friend the pistol, hey? <gasps> oh no! Oh no, no! Oh no, I'm getting flashbacks to that guy in, in the bear trap. I couldn't get out! I couldn't get out of that! Oh no, how do I get my leg out? <laughs> Select your leg to free it. Oh, I see. So we gotta do a few things here. Alright, so let's get our leg and then look up and shoot that guy and get our leg and then look up and shoot that guy. Get our leg. Look up. Nope. Get our leg. Yes! Okay, come on, Lee. Come on. Shoot them! Is that Clem? Oh no, it doesn't matter. Let's just go, let's go, let's go. We got a gun, we got a hatchet. <laughs> He's gone. Oh, this is awesome, this is awesome. Oh. <laughs> I love this, I love this. This is so much fun. <laughs> he took my hatchet though. Come on! Come on, let's go. <laughs> yes, I'm right, safe, Claire. but we gotta go. Any way out of here? This leads to the roof. We might be able to find a way down from there. You didn't come into town from the railroad, did you? Yeah. Why? Never mind. I can see the sewer where we came in from here. What's he talking I think about? we can do this. Well, what are we waiting for? Really go, go! That. Okay, so we're almost back down in the sewer. We can do it. Come on, we are so close now. Come on, let's go! Oh, that's gonna drag them right to us though. Who's doing that? Oh my god! Well, that's him taken care of. Hold on, Ben. I've got you. Kenny won't like this. 
I'm gonna have to drop him. Hey. Here, climb up. Come on, you can do it. Kenny won't like this. There's no time. You have to go now. Quit fucking around, Ben. Come on. He won't. Let go, damn it. Get Clem and the others out of here. Lee. We're gonna have to let him. He doesn't want him anyway. We're gonna have to let him. We're gonna have to let him drop. Lee. We both know. Yep. Yep. Let me go. <sighs> Sorry, Ben. But we have to. <laughs> we have to let him go anyway. <laughs> I feel <laughs> I feel really bad, but I think that was the right thing to do at that point. I think that was the right thing to do. I'm sorry, Ben, but he couldn't come on the boat anyway. Krista? Everything okay? Oh, me! <gasps> oh, no! He's dead! He's dead. Krista, don't. Oh, Stay no. back. I never should have left you. I'm so sorry. He's dead. Krista, and he's, get away from him. He's going to turn. Uh, oh. Hey. Back already? <laughs> we he got was you asleep. Medicine. Good. Feel like I could use some. Oh. That's good. Where's Ben? He tricked me. He didn't make it. What happened? Dumb son of a bitch nearly got us all killed. Lee stepped up and did what he had to. That's what happened. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Clementine. Nice going, asshole. What's eating you? Yeah, I did what I had to. But I don't expect Clementine to understand that. Hell. I don't want her to understand it. You did the right thing. Trust me. She'll understand. Maybe. I'm gonna go start work on the boat. Okay. Okay. With a little luck, you should start feeling better pretty soon. I'll stay here for a few more hours to check on him. Let me know if you need anything. Wonderful. Thanks, Doc. Yes. Thank you so much. <laughs> Maybe now's a good time for you and me to have a little talk in private what about okay what about he wants to come on the boat i know he does Listen, man. about what happened to brie don't beat yourself up over it there was nothing you could have done you want to know the worst part what i don't feel much oh. i mean i don't feel enough shouldn't i be broken up over what happened to her that's how i was when i lost my daughter when I lost my friends in those first few weeks. But now, it's like I just take something like this in stride. Yeah. Like this is what our world is now, and we'd better just get used to it. Mm-hmm. What did you want to talk to me about? I get it. I know you care about Clementine. Anyone can see that. Yes. And I know you want what's best for her. But yes. this plan of yours, putting everyone on a boat with no destination, do you really think that's her best chance of finding somewhere where she can be safe? Yes. Because I don't. So I want to make you an offer. What? What kind of an offer? I'll take her off your hands. Take her back with me. No. To We're well supplied, well hidden. I see it. A lot of us have had kids of our own. And now Crawford's fallen, we got nothing left to fear from them. No. She'll be safe with us. Safer than she will be if she stays with you. I don't I think so. That's what you want for her, isn't it? To be safe? Mm -mm. I'm gonna pretend you didn't say any of this and give you a chance to walk away. Which you ought to do right now. I know you think you're doing what's best for her. And if you were her real father, we wouldn't be having this conversation. But you're not. And staying with you is not what's best for her. If no one else around here will tell you that, then I will. That little girl's in my care. 
We've been through more together than you can imagine. Anyone who tries to get between me and her, anyone, is gonna wind up dead. You hear me? Take your hands off me. <laughs> he went a bit too far. Lee, calm down. Calm down, buddy. But there's no way I'm giving up Clementine. What? As if I would let her go with him. I do understand, though. I do get it. We're not exactly the safest place for her to be. But no way. She's with us. No way. Hey, going somewhere? Yeah, I'm about to head out. I, I just wanted to say thanks for everything. It's been fun. <laughs> fun. <laughs> what are you talking about? Kenny's working on the boat right now. Thought you were coming with us. God knows you earned it. Yeah, I've been thinking it over. It's not for me. Oh. Sounds like it'd be pretty crowded, and I never did like the water. <laughs> You sure about this? Oh, okay. I'm sure. I've always done better on my own, anyhow. Okay. Listen, I'm not much for goodbyes. Tell the others for me? Sure. Hmm. You take care of yourself, Molly. You too, Lee. I liked her. I liked her. She'll be fine here, though. She runs this town. And you be sure to take care of that little girl. You know she thinks the world of you. Good luck. Yes. Ain't nothing to do with luck. <laughs> okay. At least we lost one to just a goodbye and not a death. Damn. Clem? Hey, sweet pea. Kenny's working on the boat. I know. Yeah. What are we going to do after he fixes it? Where will we go? Um... Someplace else. Someplace better. Clem, honey, what's wrong? What happened to Ben? What did Kenny mean when he said you did what you had to? Clem, you have to believe me. I tried to save him, but Ben didn't want me to. What do you mean? What Ben did was very brave. He knew we were running out of time, and that saving him might put everyone else in danger. So he told me to leave him behind so the rest of us could get away. Yeah. I know that's difficult to understand. I understand. You do? Yeah. He thought about other people before he thought about himself. Wow. My mom always told me that's what makes a good person. Yes. Well, she was right. Before we leave tomorrow, will we have time to look for my parents? I don't think so. I'd like to, Clem, but I don't think we'll have time. We really shouldn't stay here any longer. It's not safe. They're not here. They're, if they're here, they're dead. I'm so sorry. They're gone. But who's that person on the walkie-talkie, though? Who was that person? I don't know. That's so sad. <laughs> she won't be able to find them. <sighs> Clementine? <gasps> Where is she? Where is she? Not again. Come on now. Come on Clementine? now. Clementine? Don't you be doing this again. Is she out with the others? Where is everyone? Oh no, what? Where is everyone? They're probably just outside working on the boat, right? Clementine? Please. Clementine! Oh <gasps> no. No, this is just another trick. 
It's fine. They're probably just working on the boat. Unless she's gone with that person on the walkie-talkie. She wouldn't leave her hat behind. Walkie-talkie. What? Yeah. Where is she gone? What's happened? She's dropped it. She's dropped that, her hat. What's happened? Oh, jeez. Oh, boy. Who is that? Who is that? It's no one we know, right? Okay. Damn it. Where is she? Oh. No. No. What? No. 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 Oh, fuck. Lee? Lee? You out here? Lee? Oh my god, no way. No. Are you crazy? What are you doing out here? Oh, it ain't no. safe. Lee? Where's oh, Clementine? No, 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 no. She's not in her room. Vernon ain't in the house either. What the hell is going on? Whose blood is that? It's a walker's. Fucker jumped me from behind. So where's Clementine? Clementine's gone. I found her hat and her radio on the ground out here. That's all I found. There's no chance oh she just wandered off on her own? No. Oh my god. No way. Oh my god. And who the hell took her? I don't know. Last night Vernon came to me and offered to take her with him. Said she'd be better <gasps> off. What Son if he took her? I knew we couldn't trust that fucker. Wherever she is. What if it's him? I have to find her. Oh. There's I have to tell. I have know. to tell. I have to um, tell. I'm bitten. Walker jumped me while I was out here looking for her. Oh my god. No way. I had to tell. No. No fucking way. I don't know how much time I've got. I'm gonna need your help to find her. Who's with me? We're all responsible for Clementine. And in your condition, you may not make it to her in time. She needs our help. Can we just all cut off her help. arm? Damn right. Like... We can't let you do this alone. So that's settled then. We'll look for Clementine together. Hell yeah. What are we waiting for? Thanks, you guys. I appreciate it. Oh really. no, I don't want to lose him. You've always been there for me, Lee. Always had my back when it mattered. What kind of friend would I be if I wasn't there for you now? Bitten or not, I'm with you to the end. You can count on me. Okay, guys, we should go find Vernon. See if he took her. I don't want to lose him. Out. What about the boat? We just gonna leave it unguarded? <sighs> if someone was gonna take it, they'd have done it already. Besides, what choice do we have? Yeah, we gotta get her back. We gotta get her back. I think it was Vernon. Or the person on the walkie talkie. I don't know. Where is she? Oh my god. This is terrible. Oh my god. We're back in, in Vernon's bunker. Whoa. I don't think it's Vernon, you know. I have this feeling. I don't think it's him. I just don't. He's gone. They're all gone. If it is him, they've taken her. Where the hell are they? Hmm. Looks like they got out of here in a hurry. Vernon! Yep. Get out here! There doesn't have to be any trouble here. All I want is the girl. Give her back and nobody needs to get hurt. He took her. He lost his daughter, so uh. he's taken Clementine. Uh. <sighs> Great. No, come on. It's gonna be one of 
them soon. I don't know how long he has. You guys aren't coming in here. Oh. Where are you? Are, are you all right? Where are you? Vernon, you son of a bitch! Cody? Who is it? Where have you taken her? This isn't Vernon. And you should really watch your tone. Clementine's fine. But if I were you, I'd choose my next words very carefully. Time left episode five. Oh my god. Whoa. Whoa. Let's have a look at some of these responses. The boy in the attic. Did you kill the boy in the attic? Hardly anybody did. Only 25% of people killed him. I feel re I feel like a monster. I feel like a monster. Most players were rational and honest to Vernon, which I like to be honest. Oh, 55% of players brought Clementine with you to Crawford. Did you let Ben fall to his death? 47% of people let him go. So a little bit more people took him with them, but we don't have enough room for him on the boat anyway. Ah, oh, most people showed the bite. I'm so glad that I did that. I want, I hid it at first because I thought, I don't know, I just thought I could get away with it. But I, I've played this whole game so far being very honest and open with everybody. I couldn't keep hiding it. Oh, who came with you? Oh, what? 13%. I've got Omid. Krista, Kenny, and Lee. Wow. Some people have just got Lee on his own. Jeez. <laughs> they must be playing it <laughs> really differently. The most popular one here is to have Ben here as well. There's even one that doesn't. There's two. There's three that don't have Kenny. How do you not get Kenny? I don't know. <laughs> I thought he was like one of the main characters. Okay, I'm happy with our little group. I honestly am happy. This has been an absolutely fascinating episode. I've loved every moment of it. I am traumatized that Lee has been bitten and I feel so sad because he is not going to be able to survive. I I now know that from seeing his bite, he doesn't survive and because there's no way, there's no way that he is going to survive. He's going to turn into one of them and I don't know when. I just hope that we have enough time to get Clementine back. That's something that I really need to do. I need to get Clementine back. I need to get her safe. And I don't know who is the guy on the walkie talkie, but that's who she's been talking to for ages now. And he has now got her. After all this time, he now has what he wants. Oh my goodness. We lost a couple of people in this episode. We lost Chuck and we lost Ben, but I didn't want him to come with us anyway. And probably in the next episode, you know what? We're gonna lose Lee because of his bite. I am going to take some time now <laughs> to prepare myself because I am not going to be happy. I really like him. Thank you so much for watching episode four of The Walking Dead, the Telltale series. I hope you are enjoying this as much as me. I love it so much. You have a wonderful day and I'll see you again very soon. Bye.